So I'm using the iPhone simulator here just to demo the iRhyme app. I'll click into it. From the splash page, I can click right into an instructions sheet, which gives me several just little boxes that will tell me how each of the different button areas work on the app. And from that instructions sheet, I can always click back out to the splash page. Splash page has a web address on it where we can look for updates or news about the app. And just clicking on the splash page will take us right into the app. You can see that there are three key areas on the app. Top, center, bottom. Uh, the bottom area has all of the typical endings of single syllable words in English and an index that will take you from vowel letter to vowel letter. So you can see we're starting with the letter A endings here. If we click on E, we go to the endings, uh, the end of the letter A groups and into the beginning of the letter E groups. I takes us to the I's and so on through, through the end. So if I pick one of these, Ace goes up into the yellow box in the center area uh, and the chunk gets read aloud for me and from the top I can pick a beginning chunk to go on the front of that rhyme so if I pick this blank ace it tells me that ace is a real word and it doesn't have to add anything to the beginning of that but if I go a few letters down I click the yellow box to clear it Ace. Face. I get face. So uh, I can do the same kind of indexing up at the top uh, as I could down at the bottom. It's a little bit different though. It's done with dots. So the dots show me one letter, one sound. Click to the beginning of that. Then I have a whole series of beginnings of these single syllable words where it's one letter and one sound. If I click to this index item, I begin to get the letters, uh, the groups of letters where I have two letters and one sound. So two letters, one sound. See how the dots work? And I go all the way through the end of those, or I can just index to two letters, two sounds. Brings me right to my BL, BR, and so on. So let's just try clearing this. Let's do it. Ack. Ack. Bl bl black. And I get my real word there. So uh, I have three letters, two sounds for sk, sure, squ, so on. And then I have finally my three letters, three sounds for skr and spul. So the idea is, is that I can use these rhymes and these beginnings to make any single syllable word in the English language. The app will tell me whether it's a real word or whether it's not. Let's just try a fake word quick. Ace. Tells me it's not a real word and it doesn't read the fake word out loud for me. It only reads the chunks. So let's uh, just do a quick look at a swear word. Oh, you see where I'm going, don't you? Let's clear this. Let's pick the it. It chunk. Let's go here. Two letters, one sound gets me my sh. Shh. Not cool. And even though it lets me spell the word, uh, it doesn't read it out loud for me. So just a little bit of a protection for the kids. And let's try this one here since Itch. we're here. B uh, 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 uh. So uh, it doesn't uh, allow it to read out loud for them. So in a nutshell, that's what the iRhyme app does. It allows you to use onsets, beginning of words, match them up with rhymes, and make real words uh, and fake words and know the difference between the two.